pole is set up in the center of the ground and a member sits in a chair to ground the pole normally. Four or eight members led by or including the captain enter the field in single file as including a slow march. The captain approaches the pole first, unraveling the ribbons, and the members travel anti-clockwise around the pole until they're equidistant apart. On the call pole, members go to the pole and retrieve the ribbon, which they hold in their right hand, using their left hand to thread or trace the ribbon. On reverse, they return to their assigned position and turn under the ribbon. On the call partner, they face their partner. On the call reverse, they go under the ribbon and face the pole. On the call quarter turn, they go quarter turn with their partner. On the call reverse, they return to the position, go under the ribbon and face the pole. On the call run change, the maneuvers start. Members going either inside and outside in an anti-clockwise direction and those facing the left go outside and inside in a clockwise direction. This is called run change. When the captain calls face park, they face the pole. On the turn pole, they go towards the pole. On the pole reverse, they go under the ribbon. And then, rerun change, they unplat the maypole. This plaiting and unplaiting of the maypole can be done with 4, 8, 12, or any multiples of 4 in the pole. The captain may be said to unplat and plat the maypole as many times as he wishes. It is important for the members to stay equidistant apart and continue to keep the ribbon taut. As the music gets faster, the members can begin to dance as they plait and unplait the maple. At the end, the members go anti-clockwise around the pole. They give the ribbons to the captain and proceed off the parade ground. 